Over the years, Japan's infrastructure has developed significantly. The nation has a top-notch transportation infrastructure made up of well-maintained highways, effective subway systems, and high-speed trains like the Shinkansen, all thanks to careful design and cutting-edge technology. Furthermore, Japan has made investments in cutting-edge infrastructure initiatives like the incredibly fast maglev train. The nation's dedication to sustainability is demonstrated by the creation of eco-friendly structures that use smart technologies and renewable energy sources. Furthermore, as a sign of its proactive attitude to disaster preparedness, Japan has built resilient infrastructure to survive natural calamities. Japan has become a global leader in infrastructure development via persistent innovation and investment. Welcome back to our YouTube channel and thank you for joining us. In this video, we will be exploring 10 mega projects ongoing in Japan. If you are new to this channel, do well to like and share the video and hit that subscribe button to join our channel. Number 10, Logi Square Kyotonabe. The project involves the construction of logistic facilities with a floor area of 243,412.19 square meters comprising two buildings on 10.48 hectares of land in Kyotonabe, Kyoto. The project aims to provide better logistics and storage facilities in the region. Construction work started in 2023 and is expected to be completed in 2026. Number 9, Haneda Airport Terminal 2 North Satellite Building. The project involves the expansion of the Terminal 2 North Satellite Building with a floor area of 322,000 meters square at Haneda Airport 3 Chrome, Otaku, Tokyo. Construction work commenced in 2023 and is expected to be completed in 2025. The project aims to increase the number of international flights and the convenience of transit from domestic flights to international. Number 8, Nagoya City Mizuho Park Athletic Stadium Development. The project involves the total demolition of the current stadium and the building of a brand new facility from the ground up in its stead. An athletics track and two tiers of covered stands with a combined capacity of 30,000 seats, possibly 35,000 with the addition of temporary seats, will be located on either side of the new stadium. The stadium's roof will be distinguished by its rather asymmetrical design. Wooden components will be used to embellish the stands from the exterior. The building is meant to symbolize the ground, the forest, and the sky on a metaphorical level. The second tier of stands will be covered by a hallway that belongs to a particular building. It is to be used as a public running track for recreational runners daily. A footbridge across the Yamazaki River will connect it to the second outdoor running track, forming a figure-eight configuration when combined. Constructed began in 2023 and is projected to end in 2026. 7. The Redevelopment of Mita. The Mita is a real estate construction project located southeast of Minato, Tokyo, and is a mixed commercial and residential area. The redevelopment project of this building involves the construction of Mita 3 Chom and 4 Chom. The project area spans over 5,799 square meters and includes a 255-unit residential area, a 43-story office building, and kindergarten and specialized schools. The project is expected to increase business, tourism, and transportation in the area as it is along the neighboring Takanawa Gateway. The execution of this project is expected to be over by the end of 2023. Number 6, Tokyo Disneyland Tomorrowland New Attraction Development. The project involves the construction of a 10,683-meter square, two-story steel building on 7.5 hectares of land in Uriasu City, Tokyo. This two-story building is said to be named Space Mountain. The design of the new attraction structure appears to have been influenced by Tomorrowland at Shanghai Disneyland. It features a similar big slope leading up to the attraction as Tron Light Cycle Power Run, which is now a clone of Magic Kingdom called Tron Light Cycle Slash Run. Blue light highlights the building's curved shapes. Given the amount of room set aside for the new room mountain, the iconic boxy gravity building from Cosmic Rewind may resemble something similar. For this project, about $437 million will be needed. The Coca-Cola partnership and the Space Mountain name and motif will remain intact. The renovated Tomorrowland Plaza will open alongside the new Space Mountain in 2027, with the present version closing in 2024. Construction work started in 2023 and is expected to be completed in 2027. The project aims to provide better leisure facilities in the region and it will be possible to enjoy a space trip that is more thrilling and exciting than ever before. Number 5, Tyrannomon Tuchome Development. 
This is a real estate construction projection carried out in Tokyo which is focused not only on offices and shopping malls but also on the renovation of the Tyrannomon Hospital, the National Printing Office, and the Commonwealth Communication Agency. The project is being developed on an area of approximately 22,500 square meters and is a skyscraper with 38 floors and two underground floors. This development is situated at the intersection of three metro stations, Tamaiksa New Station on the Metro Ginza Line, Tyrannomon Station, and Tyrannomon Hill Station on the Metro Hibia Line. The second floor of the building provides direct access to Tyrannomon Station. Its execution is projected to close by the end of 2023. Number 4, Mori Buildings Tyrannomon Azabudai Project. Mori Buildings Reconstruction Project, which is the largest and longest planned rehabilitation project of the Mori Group, took about 30 years to complete, with a total development cost of 580 billion Japanese yen and an area of 8.4 hectares. When the main tower is finished, it will be taller than the Abino Harukis building in Osaka, standing at 330 meters, making it the highest structure in Japan. A high-class residential complex named the Aman Tokyo Residences will be built on the 54th to 64th floors of the 330-meter skyscraper. The cost of each unit will be at least several billion yen, which is the maximum amount for any condominium in Japan. Buyers will be required to submit financial documentation and other documents for review. Number 3, Kitakyushu Hibikinata Offshore Wind Farm. The project involves the construction of an offshore wind farm with a total generation capacity of 238 megawatts installed on a 2,700 hectare site within the port area of the Hibikinata district of the port of Kitakyushu, Fukuoka. The wind farm will comprise 25 9.6 megawatts wind turbines, most likely the pre-selected Vestas V174 model. Offshore wind energy is expected to play an essential decarbonization role in Japan. In its sixth strategic energy plan approved in October 2021, the government of Japan established offshore wind as a vital means of achieving an electricity supply system dominated by renewable energy. Construction work started in 2023 and is forecast to complete in 2025. The project aims to meet the growing electricity demand and enhance electricity generation using renewable sources in the region. Number 2, 2025 Osaka Kansai Expo. Expo 2025 is an upcoming World Expo organized and sanctioned by the Bureau of International De Expositions, BIE, which will be held in Osaka, Japan. The theme for the expo is, Designing Future Society for Our Lives, with sub-themes of, Saving Lives, Empowering Lives, and, Connecting Lives. The theme, Saving Lives, includes infant vaccinations, sanitation, lifestyle, diet and exercise, and extending lifespans. An extension of the Osaka Metro Chuo line is planned from its current terminus at Cosmo Square Station using the Yumsaki Tunnel. The Expo 2025 Osaka aims to contribute to the achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals (SDGs) and activation of Japan's economy and the Osaka, Kansai regional economy and strengthen the management of small and medium enterprises. The project involves the development of an exhibition center on a 390 hectare area in Yumashima, Osaka. Construction work commenced in 2023 and is expected to finish in 2025. Number 1, Central Tokyo to Haneda Airport Rail Line. The project involves the construction of a 7.40-kilometer railway line from Central Tokyo to Haneda Airport in Japan. The proposed rail line will connect the Haneda Airport's new subterranean station to the Tokyo Freight Terminal. Between Terminals 1 and 2, the new station, henceforth dubbed Haneda Airport New Station will be constructed. A new access line linking the airport and the Tokyo Freight Terminal is part of the plans. Three sections of the project are being considered, the coastal route from Shinkiba Station, the West Yamano route connecting Shinjuku Station, and the East Yamano route connecting Tokyo Station. The project will involve modifying key parts, renovating the freight line's track, and extending an existing freight line to the airport. Construction work started in 2023 and is expected to be completed in 2031. The project is estimated to involve a construction cost of $2.1 billion, including $502 million for the construction of a tunnel. The project will be connecting Haneda Airport to Tokyo and Shinjuku stations. Once complete, the project will reduce the traveling time from Haneda Airport to Tokyo and Shinjuku stations to about 18 and 23 minutes respectively, and the travelers will benefit from easier and faster access through three routes to the Haneda Airport. 
This ends our journey through 10 mega projects in Japan. Thank you for watching to the end. Please do well to leave a review and comment on what you think about this video. Until next time, stay safe.